The International Conference Center in Abuja hosted the book presentation on the challenges of leadership in Nigeria, a case study of President Muhammad Buhari. The author, John Pedden, a professor of international studies who has also done a book on late Sardana of Sokoto, Sir Amadou Bello, describes President Buhari as a charismatic leader who would never do anything except it benefits the country. The event was attended by three presidents from Chad, Niger, and Benin Republic, and two former Nigerian leaders, Chief Olushegun Obasanjo and General Yakubo Gawan, amongst other prominent Nigerians. Let me note that over the years I have witnessed the emergence of President Buhari as a charismatic figure to millions of young people who have looked to him for reform. Since taking office, I have also witnessed his emergence as an international statesman. I have tried to remain objective since over the years I have worked with Nigerians on, on all points of the political spectrum. At the same time, let me assure you that the international community and many who wish Nigeria well are hopeful that the new team in Abuja and throughout the country will pull together and face the challenges of leadership. Second challenge is stemming corruption. This is related to Buhari's passionate concern to stem the cancer of corruption and insist that government is meant to assist all people and not just the few. This is especially cruel when the few have backdoor access to oil wealth. The third challenge is promoting economic welfare. It is often said that, blessing, that oil can be a, a blessing or a curse. What is obvious is that oil can be a blessing to those with power, while those without power can be left behind. President Buhari has dedicated his life to trying to ensure that opportunities for development are extended to those at the grassroots level. In the meantime, former head of state General Yakubo Gawan has described President Mohamed Buhari as one who has surmounted all challenges before him in attaining the leadership position. As the chairman of the book presentation event, General Gawan says he's confident, given the president's pedigree, that the nation will come out of its present economic crisis. I guess, President, his election in 2015 as president. Uh, in a free and fair election is therefore an affirmation of the notion that persistence pays. He is like the Irishman, third time lucky, but not for a third time. It has, however, been his unavoidable lot to twice lead Nigeria at extraordinarily difficult times when the economy needed to be quickly rescued. Truth to tell, Mr. President has been doing his best to get things going to ensure that the economy is restored to good health and the suffering of the masses of the people is elevated.